During the past several months, I have attended funerals for three of our beloved diocesan clergy, Father Anna Kasparian, Father Karnik Halajan, and Father Dajad Davidian. While I knew Fathers Anna and Karnik well, Father Dajad I knew better. He was my pastor. We also worked closely together for five years when I served as the administrative director of the St. James Parish in Watertown, Massachusetts. During each funeral, I listened to the particular eulogies offered, describing each one's years of dedicated service to the Armenian Church, their particular priestly attributes, human characteristics, and what now would be their legacies. I smiled with fond remembrances at some of the comments spoken, questioned some, shed a tear or two with others, and wondered what they themselves would have thought of what was being said about them. It had me thinking about my own mortality and what others would perhaps mention when my time arrived. Then I came to the conclusion that it really wouldn't matter what would be said. My wife, who knows my inner soul better than anyone, would not need here a summary of my life as a family man or even as a priest. She has lived all those years with me, experiencing much of what I had experienced, as did my kids. For them, no scripted words would be necessary. My closest and oldest friends who have known me since childhood would not need to hear any accolades about me, if any were to be offered at all. Our friendship for decades would reach far beyond any words that would be offered. For those whom I was a trusted priest, a teacher, a confidant and friend, their presence would be sufficient of me having done for them what I was ordained to do. For those who would feel otherwise, well, most likely they'll stay home that day. On our headstones, there will be two dates, the date we were born and the date we died and in between a dash. It is that dash that will symbolize our lives, what will be remembered about us that will speak volumes. Life is full of choices. It is the choices we make in life that will express who we truly are and have been. Make sure you get the big ones right. And as always remember, whatever it is you do, ultimately, the choice is yours.